Hi, thanks for logging on to the MathCast for the week of September 18th through September 22nd. I'm Mrs. Williams, your math teacher. So we had some issues with Remind. Remind was trying to block many teachers from sending messages. They were giving districts limits, so we were able to kind of circumvent that, and hopefully um, we won't have any more issues with Remind uh, moving forward. So in AIM this week, we're going to be looking at Unit 2, which is ratios. We're going to be starting with um, lesson one and moving through lesson eight this week. So talking all about ratios. So if you're um, a, a baker at home, include your kids in um, cooking and talk about how when things double or triple and what the recipes look like. All about ratios and then also how it tastes. Um, in math six, we are going to continue through unit one on surface area. We're going to be really talking about surface area and exponents this week. We'll be moving through lessons 13 and lesson 17. I will be out on Thursday and Friday, and so students will still have work to do in class and also homework. So just double check with them and make sure they're watching the lessons for those in class and then doing the homework to go with those lessons so we can stay on track. There's lots going on with the ratio unit. We've asked that everyone send in juice boxes, um, really juice pouches, Capri Sun, uh, the Kool-Aid jammers, or like the Honest Pack, so that we um, have enough drinks so that all kids can kind of participate in the lab that we're doing for math that kind of has to do with ratios. So um, I'll let your imagination run wild with that because that would be so much fun drinking Kool-Aid in glass. I'll make sure I... Uh, have them drink it right before they come home. No, just kidding. We'll be drinking that throughout the day. Um, lots of um, clubs have already started or in the works. We have Student Council, Gamers Unite, Math Club, Chess Club, and ITS Club. Um, the ITS Club is club. Sorry, is the um, theater club, and that I think is invite only. It's those kids who have participated in a theater production. Um, so those meet today. And then um, Monday, on Tuesday, we have FBLA Club, Chess Club, and also on Tuesday are Fall Pictures. So please make sure you pre-order those pictures so that um, that can be done. Everyone will have a picture taken regardless because it's also for the yearbook. Also, order your yearbook. Right now, it's $38. Um, I think after February, it goes up to $50. So get that ordered. Wednesday, we have Spanish Club, Run Walk Club art club, catch-up club, and there's a football game at Kernodal Middle. On Thursday, um, there's a morning meeting for FBLA. I think FBLA meets Tuesday and Thursday morning. Impact Club on Thursday morning. I believe they need a permission slip to join the Impact Club in Miss Matherly's room. Choir Club in the afternoon, and then Into the Woods auditions will take place on Thursday, September 21st. My birthday. But I won't be here. But, um... On Friday, there is a PTO Sky Zone night until 10 p.m. So that sounds like so much fun at Sky Zone. Um, it's probably glow and all that stuff. So super fun. Um, so we're going to continue through. We're moving right along. I know that students were, um, their hearts were heavy about some of their test scores. I'm actually going to be looking at their paper copy. Um, so the grade that they get on Canvas is not necessarily the grade they're going to get on power school power school is the final word so don't really pay a lot of attention to canvas you can pull up the test and see what their answers are unfortunately you can't see what they did to solve them but i do have their paper test i'm going to work through those paper tests and grade um, students papers that way so that they can get credit for their work especially with this unit because it is so um there's so much that they need to be able to explain with surface area and area. And geometry just doesn't lend itself well to the computer. We will be doing computer tests this year just so that we're ready for the test that we take in May, that big test that we like to take. Um, thank you, State of North Carolina. So it gets us ready and kind of helps us figure out test strategies for taking a test online. So we still need to work things out on paper but we have to make sure our answer that we input online is our final and best answer. So we'll keep working through all of that. Thank you for your patience. Um, and at any point, if you have any questions, please let me know. Thanks so much. Looking forward to a great week.